Let me take care of that first. No, not a problem, yeah. Just a moment, excuse me. I get it, I get it. Okay, so uh, I'm having a client right now, so you can just um, take care of that first and then you can come back to me, yeah? Sure, okay. No problem, yeah. Hi, sorry to keep you waiting. So how can I help you? Uh-huh. Um, uh, just a moment, are you? Let me check. Okay, so you are my three o'clock. Okay, my three o'clock. So you're alone today? Are you, I mean... All right, last time I met your fiance. Yeah, that's why I'm confused. So you're with her? Mm -hmm. Not great, great. So are you be alone today? I mean, she's not coming with you? No? Okay. Uh, it's my eat today. Eat, eat party. I mean, eat celebration. Thank you so much for noticing. Thank you. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah, I, I just, you know, this kind of... Um, my face is a little bit greasy and all because I just came back for the party and I know it's my holiday, it's my off time, off day, but uh, yeah, I cannot let the customers down, right? So here I am. No problem, no problem. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so um, like we don't have to wait for anyone, so we can just go ahead and proceed. Like, no, this will be a, a very simple uh, thing that I would like to ask you. So that's why I need to know whether you can answer all my questions. Because I believe um, both of you should be present here. Is it alright just with you? No problem, no problem. Okay, sure, 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 no problem. So, um, first things first. Um, so the marriage we will be you, right? You and your fiancé, okay? It's love marriage, yes, of course. You don't have to tell me that. I can see it. It's love marriage, right? <laughs> mm -hmm. Great. So, um, uh, let me ask you the first thing first, okay? So, what is the overall budget for the wedding? Like, um, because I can go from the very expensive one to the bare minimum one, you know, we can just... Um, yes, we can help you with that. If you... Some couples, I mean, um, they have... Uh, some financial constraint and they want to reduce the budget for the wedding and all So far so good. Yeah, we don't have any problem But if you do have like because we need very much um, Very straightforward about this. You have to tell me the bare minimum a budget that you have Yeah mm -hmm. How much is the budget? Just a moment. Let me uh, Take my phone here, okay. So the budget will be just a moment. Mm -hmm. The budget will be uh, your budget for this wedding. Mm -hmm. You're not sure. Um, last time when I um, had this Zoom meeting with your fiance, she said that. Um, she was not sure either at that time so I really wish that you could tell me the exact price the exact rate I mean the exact uh, budget that you you having right now yeah the wedding will be for another two and a half months right so we don't have much time you cannot tell me the budget right now um, see the thing is I can only work and I can only go to the next question if I get the budget clear budget about this okay approximately maybe you know like the minimum and the highest maybe you have the minimum a uh, number in your head like mm -hmm. how much all right 24 lakhs right 24 lakhs means uh, let me just put it in dollars here because 24 lakhs just a moment I still get confused with this okay 24 lakhs uh, if we it will be around twenty thousand dollars okay that's the maximum the maximum that you're having the minimum 10 lakh okay 10 lakh will be 
10 like will be around um, just a moment 10 like okay 10 like will be around 11,000 12,000 max right okay that we can work it out we can work that out all right so I can say that minimum is uh, 10 lakh and the maximum is 24 lakhs right okay fine yeah no problem we can just uh, you can just tell me the budget first and then we'll go after that yeah uh, okay, how large is the bridal party? I mean like uh, for the bridal party like for the groom and No, we don't take care of the uh, What do you say? Um, bachelor party. That's I think that's Western culture We don't do that. We don't provide such thing here. I'm so sorry Yeah If you wish then you can take it take care of that on your own mm -hmm. Okay, so uh, so how many like uh, the how many bridesmaids are you going to have and groomsman? You haven't decided yet. No, please don't do that. You have to decide it right now. I mean like okay, just we'll go like this. Minimum and maximum the numbers of the people, the bridesmaid and the groomsman, how many you're going to have at the wedding? Okay, bridesmaid will be three people. Okay, I think we can work that out. And the groomsman, same. Okay, perfect. I think it's very much reasonable. Yeah, Susan. Some people, some people can have like more than ten bridesmaids and seventeen, twenty. You know, it depends on. If they have big families and also they have a lot of bridesmaids but depends on you it is nothing like there's no fixed uh, formula for this yeah all right so uh, who else will be attending the wedding like how many that you're going to invite like uh, apart from the family no I mean like including the family I think maybe you can make it separate like uh, families how many and then uh, like invitees how many like friends, colleagues, and uh, things like that, acquaintances, if you have how many that you have in mind? 500 people, that's including family, excluding family, all right, so it will be 500 people, okay, attendees, I can say 500 people, great, I think that's very reasonable. Um. So for this wedding, um, yeah, for this wedding we're going to have uh, since um, what kind of tradition that you have? I mean, I'm so sorry to ask you this, but this kind of uh, religion that you maybe like the officiating or this non non secular wedding. Okay, this is a Muslim wedding. Perfect, Muslim wedding. Okay, so we can do one thing like uh, for the Muslim wedding, we have to. Uh, you know, divide into men and ladies, uh, like males and females, um, places. Yeah, for that, do you want to have that kind of Muslim? Are you talking about Muslim, that kind of very traditional? Or are you talking about Indonesian Muslim, like what I, like what I am, you know? Because we do have, like, uh, both together. We don't separate uh, male guests and female guests. It's all together. I'm so sorry, it's my, I think my neighbor, can you please check? I think someone is talking. Yeah, it's quite disturbing. Sure. I hope you don't mind with the sound. Sure, okay, I'm so sorry then. Okay, so you want it very like, very general type of wedding. Okay, so we don't, so we don't call it Muslim wedding, but we call it like a general type of wedding, an Indonesian type of wedding, we can say. Great, we can do that. Okay, so um, Ustad will be there. Yes, of course, Ustad, the official, uh, the official to uh, marry you together. I mean, will be there. Don't worry about that. I'm going to take care of that. All this budget from this for this wedding, it includes the officiant, the Ustad. Yes. All right. Great. Um, 
Um, so what kind of wedding are you looking for? Like simple, elegant or themed? Simple. Simple wedding, okay. So, but you have something in mind, right? Maybe like a, a little bit specific, like the style of the weddings, like the color, uh, the flowers that you need, or maybe you can just give it to us. Like we do have some brochures if you want to see. Yes, we, uh, we, I mean like we prefer giving you some options, but if you have your own, um, you know, decision in your mind, then you can also share it with us. Mm -hmm. Like, um, example, some people don't like roses, I don't know why. <laughs> they want to change it to other flowers, but everything depends on the, uh, what? Depends on the av availability, yeah. We cannot promise, I mean, we, because we have to survey the markets first. Mm -hmm. But don't worry, usually, as of now, we always fulfill our, our customers' need. So that's not a big issue. Oh, my face is very greasy, I'm so sorry. <laughs> Okay, the flowers that you'll get back to me about that, sure, but please you have to get back to me as soon as possible. So I can say theme, here you can say themed, right, because because you'll be asking for specific flowers, specific uh, colors, then we can call it theme, not simple. Themed and elegant, of course, right, great. Uh, have you decided the date, the exact date of the wedding? You have? Okay, now is uh, 11 April, so you will be having wedding um, July, right? July. July what, what date exactly? July 6th? Okay, July 6th is, is Saturday, then great, 6th or 7th. Have you decided like 6th? Okay, July 6th, perfect. Um, like, uh, I mean, because you have decided for the date, uh, Saturdays, then you, it will be weekend, so I believe, uh, yeah, yeah, actually we, we prefer, you know, we suggest our clients have the, the wedding on weekends, you know, yeah, so pe more people can attend, there's nothing really, I mean, like, it's just, you know, Okay, uh, one another uh, important question is at what time of day or night do you want the wedding to be? Like, is it like um, early morning or maybe lunch, brunch, evening time or maybe late at night, late night, you know? Okay, afternoon time? That works. Yeah, that works. Afternoon time, yeah, so you can... We can proceed with the lunch also, lunch options later on, menu, right? Okay. Uh, so this wedding, you want it to be the whole full day or maybe a couple of hours? Yeah, because for the officiant to, um, you know, to marry both of you, like to marry you, um, it will be, I think for this officiant, they need for another like one hour type, one hour time of the process, you know, like the, Mm -hmm. Yes, one hour, like the ritual for the Muslim, Indonesian Muslim, the ritual, like one hour, 45 minutes, something like that. And then we'll go for the reception, like, so maybe this wedding will be like, what? I suggest this kind of wedding can go up to five hours. Yes, five hours, I think that will be, because one hour will be for the officiant, and then since you're inviting 500 people, Okay, all right, let's make it four hours, one hour with the officiant and then three hours for the guest and everything. Right, great. Okay. Uh, the venue. Now, another important question that I would like to ask is the venue. Do you have a venue in your mind? Like something that you want to, like you just want to go there and then, you know, like let's have, let's marry there, let's ma get married there. Like do you have that kind of place in your mind right now? No? Okay, then you're leaving it to us then. Okay, so it will be like nearby or maybe far away, but since we're in Mumbai, South Mumbai, then you're looking for obviously like near South Mumbai's location. Okay, yes, great, great. 
Um, what kind of venue do you want? Like, is it indoor, outdoor? Since July will be rainy season in Mumbai, so we suggest really indoor. It will be better. Yes, indoor. Okay, yeah. Indoor, the, uh, indoor then. Uh, <clears throat> all right, another question that I would like to ask you. The dress, yes, the dress we will be handling all together, but we need to know also the budget for the dress. Some people, they don't want to go crazy for the dress. So you mean to say that at this 24 lakhs or the minimum 10 lakhs is, that includes the dresses? It's quite tough. Uh, in Mumbai, having 10 lakhs wedding, including the dress and everything, that too in South Mumbai, that's quite, that's quite a headache. So let me get back to you for the budget. Can I um, can I uh, get back to you for the budgeting and all? Like yes, yes. I will. I will. I will make that the budget not more than twenty four lakhs. Okay, that will do. Sure, great. Um, what about the makeup artist? Do you need some of the some of us like a makeup artist for that? Okay, your sister will be doing the makeup for you and both. I mean, you and your. Uh, bride, your sister. Okay, so we will go, we're going to exclude the uh, uh, what do you say the fair for this. So you don't need any makeup artist, right? What about the hairstyles? I know. I mean, um, okay, she's wearing hijab. I know she's wearing hijab, and then she'll be needing someone to help with the with the jilbab. You know, with the, all the accessory. We don't. We call it still hairstylist, even though. The hair is covered, but still, we call it hairstylist. You need it. Okay, I'll make sure to include this. Um, the invitation, will you do the invitation from yourself or do you want us to design it for you? You're going to do it yourself? Okay. Okay, you're going to personalize it and fine. So I'm going to exclude from this. What about the photographer? Photographer and video, uh, that's will be separate. Photographer will be a different person and videographer will be a different person. So do you need both? Yes, I'll make sure to include that. Okay. Um, what about the music? What kind of music will be accompanying the wedding? You'll be choosing the music. Great. Okay. No. Later on, you can share with me with the, the MP3, MP3, you know, you can share it with me by email. Mm -hmm. It's not a problem. Um, so we're going to have rehearsals also. Um, like, yes, like um, you don't want everything to go south, right? Like you don't need rehearsal. You just want to do it directly. Not a problem. Yeah, many, many couples also, they don't have rehearsals, you know, during their wedding. They, they just go for it. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so what about the valley? Like the, if the guests coming with the uh, cars, I mean the vehicles, then we need valley also for that. That will include, you need that also. Yes, we will include in the package. Uh, what about the food, snacks or beverages? You'll be choosing the, uh, the caterer. Sure. But we do have our own caterers if you interested to see. Yes, we will send send it over to you. Yeah, you can just choose it. I mean like, is it like a type of, what kind of food, like authentic Indonesian food or maybe Italian food or Chinese or whatever. Mm -hmm. Indonesian food. You have the menu with you. I mean like, you have decided. Okay, good. But, um, do you have your own caterer or something like that? You do? Okay, I'm going to exclude this, exclude this from the package. Okay, what about the... Uh, is it like a sit-down uh, lunch or a buffet-style meal? Buffet. Yes, I, will, I was about to off, offer you the same thing. Buffet will be great. But I suggest, uh, you know, uh, usually in this type of wedding, um, I think it's better to have someone, like example, you have nasi goreng with you, you know, on the counter, 
and the people go there to just take it i suggest maybe perhaps we can appoint someone there to serve them you know on the plate because sometimes people just take it whatever they want like huge you know if someone is standing there they will be a little bit feel awkward to ask for some more nasi goreng you know if someone is there with a spoon you know i think it will be better you know i mean if someone we can appoint someone there yes great we can do that we can do that uh-huh yeah so there will be no liquor right no drinks and all like wine alcohol drinks no of course <laughs> Um, the amenities during the wedding will be like, uh huh. You, you want them? I mean, you want to have a, like a photo corner there for the guest to have a photo. Okay, so you require things like uh, a photo corner where I don't think. I mean, yeah, I don't think that's a great idea. Photo corner for during that time. What do you have in mind? Okay. <laughs> do you need a live band or DJ or something like that? No? Okay, fine. No, no, yeah. What about MC for the reception? You have someone with you. Okay, so you don't need it from us, right? All right. Um, what about the, the day on the service? Do you need me there? I mean, do you need our team there? Of course. It's just uh, formal questions like, you know, we need to ask, you know, sometimes Sometimes uh, the couples, they don't want too many people there and yeah So you need three of us there, right? Great, no problem uh, Alright, so I think that sum it up, sums it up, you know like uh so far that's the questions that we need as of now so it's a little bit very much clear now uh we uh for next meeting we will come back to you with um, the plan and everything okay the budget since you have mentioned to us about the budget that you have so we're going to you have another meeting where we explain everything about the budget yes 24 lakhs that you mentioned um, can we go beyond that? I mean like more than 24 lakhs if in case No, 24 is the maximum. All right. No problem. We will do our best But if in case we think that it is very much tight, then we need to we need to omit some of the things mm -hmm. Okay, great. So thank you so much for uh, uh, coming here and have a meeting with me Do you have some questions with you? No, all right so you can decide or you can discuss with your fiance and you can explain to her about this and yes our next meeting will be um maybe next uh next three days yes next three days will be um maybe what about monday 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 great sounds great okay good all right thank you thank you for uh i want to say stopping by all right bye thank you so much eat more to you too thank you <laughs> bye bye sure